It may be Christmas Eve, but there is still time to get that last minute gift. If you remember just before you go to bed tonight that you forgot your great Aunt Ellen a gift, no problem. CBS News financial contributor Carmen Wong Ulrich is here with ways to get gifts even on Christmas Day. <laughs> Carmen, good morning to you. Good morning. Any idea how many procrastinators are out there? Oh, we've got a lot, actually. <laughs> uh, Consumer Reports found that 23% of folks, they're shopping today. Uh -huh. They have to shop today. And beginning of the week, 25% hadn't even started shopping. Now, half of these people are saying, a lot of this is financially related, right. but a full third of them are saying, we're just pro procrastinators. We just <laughs> wait till the last minute. That's just how we roll. <laughs> what, what, what kind of gifts do procrastinators typically buy? Well, actually, and it's a good gift, because this is a gift that most people, according to surveys, really want, which is gift cards. Mm -hmm. And gift cards, that's about 45% of they say, give yeah. us gift cards. Cash, who's going to say no to that? 21%. Yeah. Food gifts, 9%. And wine or liquor, can't be mad at that. About 7% of folks spend their last minute dollars on that. Okay, that's easy. Yeah. Hey, back in the day on Christmas Eve, the stores were closed like 2 in the afternoon. Right. No more, though, right? There, there is no more of that. Now, actually, today, if you are out shopping today, yeah. there are quite a few folks that are open for you, so you need to know that. Walmart's going to be open until 8 p.m. Toys R Us open until 10 p.m. tonight, which wow. is really late. Target open until 9. And we also know that Macy's across the country, about 14 stores are going to be open late. Mm -hmm. J.C. Penney, Kohl's. Now, a lot of those, you have to check your lo local listings and your local stores. Yeah. You can go check online and see how late they're open. But many, many stores open today. Mm. I, again, back in the day, if you forgot on Christmas Day, you know, you're buying uh, grandma some beef jerky or a Snickers bar <laughs> or something like that. But you say there are places to go, even they're, on Christmas Day. Even on Christmas Day. Yeah. Here's the thing. Most local grocery stores are open, and we know the grocery stores have really upped their game, so they have a lot of gifts, those food, of course, mm. and also to drug stores. So CVS is going to be open right. on Christmas Day as well. And uh, at Starbucks, a lot of local Starbucks, not all of them. You've got right. to check your local listings. I know mine is going to be open until 8 p.m. on Christmas Day <laughs> and 7 11 2. And, and you can get gifts there. What kind of gifts are we talking about? Gift certificates, those kind of well, things? Well, let's take a look at this. Oh, well, of course, oh, you, you have you have the gift cards, iTunes gift cards and right. such. You've got toys for the kids. You've got even a DVD player. And that's even CVS selling DVD players um, and tablet computers, phones. And, of course, Starbucks, you know, who doesn't? like the coffee and the hot cocoa and all the things that you can get there. So there's mm. still things that you can get on Christmas Day for the folks wow. that need it. You were saying you were at Starbucks. You saw a woman buying thirteen fifty. I did. I was there the yesterday. She was right after me. She <laughs> came up to the register with 13 gift cards, 50 bucks each, and wow. she even shocked the staff. But <laughs> good last-minute gift card shopping. <laughs> You've got some tips for us, who are going to do some last-minute shopping. Yes. You say, before you walk out the door, take inventory. Absolutely. What's the, the worst thing that we do, and a lot of us do this at Christmas, I'm guilty of this too, we go out and we forget what we've already bought. Did we already oh, buy grandma's right. present? Did we already buy? So make sure before you leave, just check and see what you've got already before you go. Make a list of who needs what mm -hmm. before you leave and check that budget because right, that last right. minute pressure really makes us spend more than we need to spend. So have a dollar amount in your mind that you're not going to bypass before you go out the door. Okay, very good advice. You also say, you ask yourself, do I really need this? tomorrow. Do you need it tomorrow? Are you going to see the person on Christmas ah. Day? If you're not going to see them until next week, maybe Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Monday, the sales are going to be insane. They're going to be incredible. Hit the stores the day after Christmas or even Tuesday if you're going to see people later in yeah. the week and do your shopping then. I mean, traditionally, the sales after Christmas have been insane. This year, you believe even better? This perhaps? year, they're even better. For example, I went to a store. I went to The Gap. In-store sales, an additional 40% off, so basically everything's at cost, and we know that that's what a lot of retailers are doing right now. 40% off is the magic number, but after Christmas, it might even be a deeper discount, so you're going to get tremendous savings after Christmas. Mm. So for yourself, Santa, good time to go after that's Christmas. Right. All right. Carmen Wong-Ulrich, <laughs> Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas to you, Russ. We'll see you soon. Thank you.